all want that one click color grade, that one LUT that's just going to be applied to our footage that's going to transform it into any look that we want. Uh, unfortunately, that just doesn't exist, but the closest thing to that is Dehancer. It's not only the best plugin for color grading, but it's the best film emulation plugin I've ever used. And I've used Film Convert and Color Labs Look Designer. And I love this one so much more. And it's by far the best film emulation plugin that you can buy. Dehancer can do so much more with so much precision that it takes color grading and film emulation to the next level and it can really help elevate and take your looks to the next level now yes this video is sponsored by dehancer but they did tell me to give them an open and honest review they didn't want me to hold back they wanted to not censor me and that's the only reason that i accepted this because i feel like if i accept stuff that misleads my audience then I'm not being true to who I want to be on YouTube. So just know that they aren't seeing this video beforehand. Uh, they have no control over what I say, but uh, you know, it is an amazing plugin that I was, I was going to buy it anyway. And then they contacted me before I did. And I'm really glad they did because I truly believe in this product. And if you don't know who I am, my name is Jeremy and I run a video production company here in the Dallas Fort Worth area. I created this channel to talk to people about business topics, to help creatives as they're starting their business with some of the problems that I faced, and just to be a creative outlet for me when uh, client work can get sometimes monotonous. So if that's something that you're interested in, please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified when I post another video. Let's get back into the video. Now you may be wondering what makes Dehancer so good. And for me, it's a combination of all all of the tools combined, but it's the closest to a one-click final look that you can get. They give you so many different film stocks to choose from. You are able to customize the image perfectly, and it's done very scientifically, which I really appreciate because I feel like getting the film look, especially on your own, can be really hard, and it's not always the most intuitive thing. This plugin completely takes that and makes it so much easier to create the film look that it's fun. You're really able to control all of your image and manipulate it how you want to for your final look. If you want a yellow green look, you can make a yellow green look. If you want a cool look, you can make a cool look. If you want some crazy look that nobody's seen before, you can do that too. And Dehancer allows you to with the tools that it has built in. But that's also why I say it's not a one click color grade because you have to do tweaks. I mean, that's what color grading is, is tweaking your image to get the best possible image. But their tools make it so easy to get that look and dial it in and I think one of my favorite tools is their film compression tool. And if you haven't opened a Dehancer before, Film compression is basically, it takes your highlights and it messes with them. So if you want to increase your highlight sting, you're able to do that. For me, a lot of the time when I'm shooting outside, the highlights in the sky can kind of get a little bit overpowering a little and put a little too much sting on the footage. So I like to use this to kind of compress that and kind of make it a little bit more gentle of a roll off in the highlights. And so using this tool, I can do that. And I absolutely love that. The other section I love is the color head and uh, color toning. I find this a lot more intuitive than printer lights and log wheels. You can manipulate the shadow, mid-tone and highlight toning how you want by literally just removing it or adding it back in all the changes that you do. You can add more yellow or blue or green or magenta just by sliding a slider. And it's so easy and intuitive that you can really dial in a lot of looks the way that you want them to be dialed in just by using this tool. And it's kind of a great way to do split toning 
and have a lot of control over your image in a shorter amount of time. You can do more in your log wheels and your offset printer lights, but this tool makes it faster to do all of that. And that's one of the reasons why I love this is it's a lot quicker to do all of these changes. But let's get into the real reason why this tool is so successful. It has all of the tools that you would need or want to recreate the film look and the way that Dehancer has designed this is it's very scientific. They've actually done a lot of film developing to understand how film is developed and you are able to move these parameters around based on an actual film stock and I think that that's the coolest thing is that they have put that time and effort into this and it really shows it just feels way more natural realistic and technical than anything else and the best part is that it is a very quick process color grading and dehancer can be as quick as five to ten minutes or as long as 30 minutes to an hour just depending on how in-depth you really want to go and what kind of look you're trying to create but what's awesome is that you can get gorgeous creamy results in a few minutes you apply this effect to either a rec 709 image or you can convert within the uh, plugin itself and change some parameters and you're off if you want to use this on a wedding or a corporate spot that needs a more natural image you can do that with some of these film stocks so it's a very versatile tool and you can actually turn the grain off and on you can turn on halation or bloom you can really again custom your look so if you are trying to go for a natural commercial look but you want to use this plugin then you're more than welcome to do that and you can use a natural color stock and then just turn off the grain or even keep the grain on just tone it down so that you have a tiny bit of grain so it adds a little bit of that film texture but keep the integrity of that commercial or even wedding I mean I seen some wedding footage done with this and it's phenomenal so it's a very versatile tool that you can use in many different scenarios but unscientifically the look just looks so creamy and gorgeous that i can't even begin to describe it so hopefully all of the footage that i've put over this have get done it justice because truly this is my favorite plugin and i have so much fun every time i open it i try to get different results and take the same clip and do multiple different grades just to kind of have fun with it and i find that i can spend hours playing around with this so it's a really fun tool to kind of just play around with as well now i will be coming out with many more videos on dehancer specifically how i use dehancer um color grading specific like films or commercials or things of that nature but i wanted to create this review to say buy it and i don't like to tell people to buy things but if you've been on the fence or you've wanted to try it out or you want this in your arsenal buy it you get 10 percent off if you use my code but it's such a great tool that i don't think you will regret it like i've regretted buying some of these other film emulation plugins i think that this is by far the best and it's been done the best and i just think that you're gonna be able to get a lot of great results with it and you won't be disappointed this plugin is dedicated to creating the film look in the most realistic and scientific way and you can go so in depth that you can create such realistic film looks. And this is why I say it's the closest thing to a one-click grade because really you can do most of your grade in this plugin and you can really manipulate the image a lot with the parameters that this plugin gives you. So that's why I say it's the closest thing to a one-click grade because theoretically you could you know, create a power grade with this specific like grade that you've done. So again, it is the closest thing, but you still have to do a bunch of tweaks in order to get it to the right spot. So if you want a true film look, then this is the plugin for you. So if you've been on the fence, there's my discount code, go get 10% off and buy it. If you like this video, please hit that like button and 
If you want to see more of what I'm doing, please subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified when I post another video. And if you have any comments on Dehancer, whether you've used it personally or you know someone who's used it or you've been on the fence, you know, please put that in the comment section below. I really like hearing feedback from people on their process, their struggle, whatever. So if you have any other video topic ideas too, please put those in the comment section below. So with that, if you have any other questions, please feel free to drop them in the comment section below. And I hope you all have a great day and you stay safe.